take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Typically by the time a rash has appeared, the urushiol oil is no longer present on the skin. However, poison ivy can be transmitted when urushiol on one person's skin or clothing, an animal's fur, or even on an inanimate object rubs off onto another person's skin, causing them to develop the poison ivy rash. Let's help you make your mark. Poison ivy produces an oil called urushiol that causes a rash in about 85% of people who come in contact with it, notes the American Academy of Dermatology. The rash isn't contagious to others. This is because it's a skin reaction to the oil. However, the oil itself can spread to others. Let's help you make your mark. Heat overloads the nerve network so effectively that the urge to scratch is abolished for hours. Relief usually comes within seconds. Here is what some of our readers have to say. Oh my gosh, hot water on a severe itch brings euphoric relief for a few seconds and then the itch stays away for hours. Take our lead. The takeaway. Although a poison ivy rash usually lasts about one to three weeks, the poison ivy oil can last years on surfaces that haven't been cleaned. Also, if for any reason a person burns poison ivy leaves, the oil can travel through air and cause a rash in the nasal passages or other airways. Take our lead. Urushiol is found in every part of the poison ivy plant throughout the year and can remain active on dead and dried plants for two to five years. Unwashed clothing, shoes, and other items that are contaminated with urushiol can cause allergic reactions for one to two years. Take our lead. It may seem like the rash is spreading if it appears over time instead of all at once. But this is either because the plant oil is absorbed at different rates on different parts of the body or because of repeated exposure to contaminated objects or plant oil trapped under the fingernails. Let's help you make your mark. The rash usually resolves on its own within a few days, although the condition can occur again. In the meantime, limit sun exposure and wear sun protective clothing and sunscreen. An over-the-counter anti-itch cream, such as hydrocortisone cream, might help ease discomfort. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.